The Palestinian Hamas terrorist movement has published video footage of the operation of the Muber, one rocket system of its own design which is presented as a short-range air defense system, TopWar.ru writes. Muber, one is a Palestinian-developed air defense system designed to combat low-flying air targets, including unmanned aerial vehicles and helicopters. Hamas forces are said to have managed to shoot down four Israeli AH-64 Apache helicopters which such a system. Any more detailed information regarding the losses and nature of damage to Israeli helicopters is currently unavailable. So far, in the long conflict between Israel and Palestine, the Hamas terrorist group has been using rockets of various types, one, Qassam rockets, Hamas initially developed and deployed Qassam rockets. These are relatively simple, homemade, and unguided rockets with a limited range. They are named after Sheikh Is Ad Din Al Qassam, a Palestinian nationalist who fought against British and Jewish forces in the 1930s. Qassam rockets are often fired at nearby Israeli communities, such as Steret and Ashkelon. 2. Grad rockets. Hamas also acquired Grad rockets, which have a longer range and greater destructive power compared to Qassam rockets. Grads are factory-made rockets that can reach deeper into Israeli territory, including cities like Ashdod and Beersheba. 3. FAR Rockets, M-75 The FAR-5 rocket, also known as the M-75, is one of Hamas's more advanced rockets. These are larger, longer-range rockets capable of reaching major Israeli cities like Tel Aviv and Jerusalem. FAR-5 rockets are more accurate and carry a larger payload, making them a significant threat to Israeli population centers. 4. R-160 rockets. Hamas has also developed or acquired R-160 rockets, which are an improved version of the FAR-5. These rockets have a longer range and increased payload capacity. Locally manufactured rockets. Hamas has attempted to domestically produce rockets, some of which are inspired by Iranian designs. These rockets may have varying ranges and levels of sophistication, but they contribute to Hamas's overall rocket arsenal. It's important to note that the use of rockets by Hamas has been a significant source of tension and conflict in the region. These rockets have targeted Israeli civilians and cities, resulting in civilian casualties and property damage. In response, Israel has conducted military operations to target Hamas rocket launch sites and stockpiles. The conflict between Israel and Hamas remains a complex and deeply rooted issue with significant geopolitical implications. The use of rockets by militant groups like Hamas has been a central aspect of this ongoing conflict.